Good morning, teacher and students. My name is Jack. In the world, more and more people begin to live in a healthy life. Therefore, more and more people begin to care about their health. In the world, a lot of people have diabetes. In 2012, there were more than 371 million people have diabetes and 187 million people don't know they have diabetes. The topic I'm going to talk about is the type 2 diabetes. The presentation has divided into three parts. First, what is diabetes and how physiology of normal body reduces the blood glucose level. Second, the type 2 diabetes symptoms and third, the further effect that causes by the type 2 diabetes. What is diabetes? Diabetes is a disease which is occur when your blood glucose level too high. There were three types of diabetes, type 1, type 2, and gestational diabetes. Normally in our body, when glucose enters into our body, it will pass through the glucose transporters number 2 and cause the beta cell release into the blood makes increase, pancreas release insulin into our blood and converting the glucose into ATP reduce the glucose level. The reducing amount of ATP will stop the potassium channel which is used to ca cause the membrane despolarization and open the calcium channel and the releasing calcium ions. The increasing amount of calcium ions is used to make sure that the insulin release is successful. But in type 2 diabetes, the body either become insulin resistant or cannot produce enough insulin which makes less glucose converting into ATP and makes the blood glucose maintain at a very high level. Type 2 diabetes is also known as IDOT onset or non-insulin dependent diabetes. It's a very common diabetes that affects the IDOT, but researchers also shows that there were an increasing number of children got affected by the type 2 diabetes in their childhood. The graph shows that the number of children from age 2 to 19 which is affected by the type 2 diabetes from 1974 and 2010. It clearly shows that how the number of children that affected by the type 2 diabetes increasing in each year. The symptoms of type 2 diabetes can be shown as slow healing source due to type 2 diabetes can lower the ability of body healing and the ability of infections resistant, increased thirst and frequent urination, increased hunger, weight loss, blurred vision and fatigue. Recently, scientists discovered new symptoms. People with type 2 diabetes also have a lower sleep efficiency. On Science Daily News, in this article, a group of scientists invited 162 participants involved into this study. 81 with type 2 diabetes and 81 with pre-diabetes. The average age of this people was 54.8 years old. In this study, scientists measured the time on bed that these people spend on sleep and the quality of their sleep. In this experiment, the researchers found out that the average sleep duration is 6 hours and 82.7% of the time they spend was in sleep which leads to a conclusion that people have diabetes type 2 have a lower sleep rate efficiency. Due to the fact, a lot of people couldn't realize that they have affected by the diabetes type 2. Or more people realize they have type 2 diabetes but not treat them quickly enough, which causes them further effect from type 2 diabetes. For example, heart and blood vessel disease such as chest pain, heart attack, stroke, 
narrowing of artery, arteries, and high blood pressure. It also causes nerve damage, kidney damage, eye damage, foot damage, hearing impairment, skin condition, and Hazemers disease. Therefore, healthy lifestyle is very important for us. Thanks for listening. This is a reference list from my presentation.